James Wilson Carmichael was an English painter, primarily known for his contribution to marine painting. He was born on June 9, 1800 in Ausburn, Newcastle, United Kingdom, and lived until his passing in 1868. Carmichael was a Romantic-era painter who contributed to the development of the marine painting genre. He created artworks in the Romantic style, which is characterized by the depiction of emotional and melodramatic scenes, as well as a focus on natural elements. Carmichael's artistic career was marked by his unique representation of seascapes, which were infused with vibrant colors and dramatic effects. Throughout his painting career, he remained loyal to the Romanticism movement, which he helped to popularize. Carmichael was one of the most notable marine painters of his time and was highly respected by his colleagues. He was part of a circle of artists who were associated with the famous British landscape painter, John Constable. While he achieved limited recognition during his lifetime, his works have since gained popularity and can be found in art galleries across the world. John Wilson Carmichael was born in Newcastle upon Tyne, Northumberland, on June 9, 1800. He went to sea at a young age and spent three years sailing between ports in Spain and Portugal. After returning, he was apprenticed to a shipbuilding firm but spent all his spare time on art. His first historical painting to attract public attention was the fight between Shannon and Chesapeake. Another important early commission was for a view of Newcastle, for which the city corporation paid him 100 guineas. John Wilson Carmichael rose to fame as a skilled marine painter. His works were shown at the Royal Academy and the Society of British Artists, including the Conqueror towing the Africa off the shoals of Trafalgar, 1841, and the arrival of the Royal Squadron, 1843. Around 1845, he moved to London, where he was already known for his talent. During the Crimean War in 1855, he was sent to the Baltic to make drawings for the Illustrated London News and painted the Bombardment of Sveeborg, which is now in the collection of the National Maritime Museum. John Wilson Carmichael retired to Scarborough, where he passed away in 1868. His daughter Annie married William Luzon Thomas, a successful artist who founded the Graphic Newspaper in 1869 and had immense influence within the art world. Before he died, John Wilson Carmichael published two books, The Art of Marine Painting in Watercolors in 1859 and The Art of Marine Painting in Oil Colors in 1864. His works continue to be celebrated for his portrayals of the sea and ships. In conclusion, James Wilson Carmichael was a renowned painter who has left a lasting impact on the art world. He was a prominent figure in the Romanticism movement and contributed significantly to the development of the marine painting genre. Throughout his career, Carmichael remained loyal to his unique style of infusing vibrant colors and dramatic effects into his seascapes. Although he achieved limited recognition throughout his life, his works have gained popularity over time and can be found in galleries worldwide.